Narrated by Abdullah bin Umar. Allah's Messenger peace be upon him said, While I was sleeping, I saw myself performing the tawaf of the Kaaba. Behold, there I saw a whitish red lank haired man, holding himself, between two men with water dropping from his hair. I asked, Who is this? The people replied, He is the son of Mary. Then I turned my face to see another man with red complexion, big body, curly hair, and blind in the right eye which looked like a protruding out grape. I asked, Who is he? They replied, He is Ad Dajjal. Ibn Kitan resembles him more than anybody else among the people and Ibn Kitan was a man from Bani al mustalik from Huzat. Narrated by Abdullah bin Umar I heard Allah's messenger peace be upon him saying, while I was sleeping, I saw a bowl full of milk was brought to me and I drank of it to my fill till I noticed its wetness flowing in my body. Then I gave the remaining of it to Umar. They asked, O oh Allah's messenger peace be upon him. What have you interpreted about the dream? He said, It is religious knowledge. Narrated by Ibn Umar Men from the companions of Allah's Messenger peace be upon him used to see dreams during the lifetime of Allah's Messenger peace be upon him, and they used to narrate those dreams to Allah's Messenger peace be upon him. Allah's Messenger peace be upon him would interpret them as Allah wished. I was a young man and used to stay in the mosque before my wedlock. I said to myself, if there were any good in myself, I too would see what these people see. So when I went to bed one night, I said, O oh Allah! If you see any good in me, show me a good dream. So while I was in that state, there came to me in a dream two angels. In the hand of each of them, there was a mace of iron, and both of them were taking me to hell, and I was between them, invoking Allah, O oh Allah! I seek refuge with you from hell. Then I saw myself being confronted by another angel holding a mace of iron in his hand. He said to me, Do not be afraid, you will be an excellent man if you only pray more often. So they took me till they stopped me at the edge of hell, and behold, it was built inside like a well and it had side posts like those of a well, and beside each post there was an angel carrying an iron mace. I saw therein many people hanging upside down with iron chains, and I recognized therein some men from the Quraysh. Then, the angels, took me to the right side. I narrated this dream to my sister Hafsa and she told it to Allah's messenger peace be upon him. Allah's messenger peace be upon him said, No doubt, Abdullah is a good man. Nafi said, since then Abdullah bin Umar used to pray much. Narrated by Ibn Umar I was a young unmarried man during the lifetime of the Prophet. I used to sleep in the mosque. Anyone who had a dream, would narrate it to the Prophet. I said, O oh Allah! If there is any good for me with you, then show me a dream so that Allah's Messenger peace be upon him may interpret it for me. So I slept and saw, in a dream, two angels came to me and took me along with them, and they met another angel who said to me, Don't be afraid, you are a good man. They took me towards the fire, and behold, it was built inside like a well, and therein I saw people some of whom I recognized, and then the angels took me to the right side. In the morning, I mentioned that dream to Hafsa. Hafsa told me that she had mentioned it to the Prophet peace be upon him and he said, Abdullah is a righteous man if he only prays more at night. Azuri said, after that, Abdullah used to pray more at night.